we've gotten to the point where we're ready to put bikes together. So today... Can I put one together? Um, I hope so. We'll see. Okay. I reckon I could give it a go. Hey, I'm Greg Minar. I've been riding Santa Cruz for almost 15 years now. I'm here at the Santa Cruz HQ, and I actually don't know what goes into packing these bikes, putting them together, and shipping them out. I think I know, man. So I've called on a buddy, Garen, to give me a factory tour and see the whole process. All right, let's give it a shot. Cardi B. You know, do you know any Cardi B songs? No. I didn't either. Can you sing one? No, but apparently there's a song called... Yeah, dude, every cart's got a name. We got Cardi B here. We got Raiders of the Lost Cart. We got Joan of Cart. We got Menard Cart. No way. Every cart's got a name. Hey, cool. Yeah, dude. So right now we're in the area where we build e-bikes, and since I don't build e-bikes, I'm going to pass you off to those who do. Travis? Crash? Hey. Hey. Yeah. Cool. Take it away, dude. Thanks, Bert. Yeah. Hey, what the hell is this? All right, this is the scanner. This is what we're going to do to make sure that it lists of everything that's going to be going in to be built on the bike. Should I clear that or not? Uh, no, we're not going to clear that. That's <laughs> actually what we're going to do is we're going to select that, make sure that we're ready to scan it, and we're going to scan the production order right there. We got the scanner up on top. And no, that's just going to push gonna, anything. It's not going. We do have a yellow button, the bright button, that makes it quite easy. Oh, there we go. There you go. Perfect. Oh, OK. So you scanned the handling unit there. You just need to make sure you scan that part oh. and not that. Cool. <clears throat> oh, pedals are reverse threaded on one side. Right. We can't give this unlucky guy these shitty grips. We have to put these puppies on. It's not going through here. Um, then we got a nasty guy up front. Good choice. Oh, it doesn't even have decals on. No, nope, we're gonna put decals on ourselves. Are you kidding me? Bloody Geordie, lazy as ever. Wait, what is this? So, that means that we're done. Oh, are you kidding? Oh, I've cocked it again. <laughs> Shit, there's so many numbers, I don't even know what to look at, bro. It gets a little overwhelming. Yeah. Yep. So we have successfully picked everything on the cart, and we're gonna get ready for the next station, which is which we're is gonna, what? We're gonna put decals onto the fork. I cannot believe you gotta put decals on a fork. <laughs> a little bit of a bubble there, but I mean that will come out with a dryer. I might need to re-decal that one. No, surely not. It's coming out. Maybe it's not. So we'll have to peel it off. We'll need to read, yep. And then we'll need to make a record of all the decals oh, that don't make be... it. There's no quick way. It's just, we're <laughs> gonna take this off. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, good to go. Let's try okay. this again. Yeah, well, round two. With all these cameras, I was just rushing. We can't I rush can here. Rushing why. leads to mistakes. I can understand why mine are skewed on my race bike, because it's not that easy. I forgive Jordy for that. What, like that? Perfect, eh? Yeah, perfect. And then start in the center and slowly work your way out, starting at the top and going down to make sure that you can move any bubbles down the line. Cool. Looking good on this side. Yeah, it's looking great so far. We're good to go. Okay, so back in the bag. Uh, not quite yet. We're gonna sit back there and get ready to cut the fork. Right there. And then it will self-adjust when it wants to. There we go. It's the right length, right? Yep, it's right at the correct length. Just like that. All the way through to yep. what? There. Yep. And then clamp it down. Good and then go. we're gonna hit the cut fork button right on that screen. So now pop that back open and we're going to insert the star nut. Shit, that was simple. And now the fork's done and ready to get put back into the bag. Cool. And we'll install it in another station later. Good job. Nice. All right, cool. So the next step we got here is going to, we're going to be installing the motor on this. And I got Kesh over here. He's going to help you install this motor. Kesh money. Hey. What are we dropping in first? So first we're going to Loctite ah. all six spots for our motor bolts. Cool. Is that perfect. enough? Yep, yeah. that's perfect. You're natural. <laughs> A natural luck time. Natural. Too. 
I strained my butt off trying to plug these things in and out. Just get one of these. <laughs> Came with your bike. The, you kidding? Yeah. Not mine. Cool. Perfect. Now we bolt it in. We're gonna try thread them in. Perfect. Hey, that's cool. Yeah. How important is the torque? Very important. Yeah. Yep. You'd be your own mechanic. Yeah. A finely tuned e-bike mechanic. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, so that so motor is goes in. in. Yeah. So next, we're gonna put the cranks on. Okay, so straight into the red bay. Exactly. Right into the red bay. This is where we do our cranks and our chain ring. So, so what goes first, chain ring? So we're gonna make sure, this is actually the other side. So we're gonna make sure we're using the left crank here. And we're gonna QC that by checking that left crank right there. And we're gonna line this tab up with that hole. I would have put the chain ring on there. <laughs> there you go. And then Back the other side the one more time. From here, we'll just tape that crank okay. with our green tape, which is over on your right there. Pull the left, the other crank towards yeah. you and push your right arm away from Cool. And just go to it torques. And then be careful when you take it off because this falls off a lot. So now we're ready to torque that chain ring down. Perfect. Okay, so we, we've been going what now? It's uh... Yeah, you've done we've a great job. We've been going job. for about an hour. We've, we've been going for an hour. You've done a great <laughs> job. Um, you're a little slow. How long does it take you to do one bike? 50. 50. Okay, so, I mean, we, we know we've been finished, but we have been over an hour, yeah. <laughs> okay, cool. That was interesting, I must say. So we got you for the whole day. You're building all these <laughs> until you're hitting cycle time. Is thing good to go? Good to go. All right. Let's do it. All right, man. So you've seen it. And uh, believe it or not, I think you surprised a lot of people here. And they might want to keep you on. But when we get back, we just got to make sure that all the bikes are actually actually built correctly. Yeah, I'm going to start going over motors and final install, yeah. make, sure, uh, make sure we build those from scratch. <sighs> Could head back to South Africa. Ah. So that's it, man. You've seen how we come up with a bike. Yeah. Design it, test it, bring it in, assemble it, how we build our wheels, and how the bikes get shipped out the door. What are all these here? Oh, these. These are uh, employee bikes. Every employee gets a hook. Everyone's got an internal yeah. place to store their bike daily. Everyone's paid to ride their bike to work. So like really? five bucks a day for me. If I ride oh, my bike that, that's yeah. cool. I wish I did it more. So we did it, man. We're finally through. Thanks for coming. Yeah, thanks for, thanks for the tour. It was great. Really yeah, good. Did, what were your takeaways? What'd you think? I was just surprised how enthusiastic each person was. It was touching from the bearings to the frame assembly to everything. I mean, it's, it's a lot of detailed work, yet everyone is so enthusiastic about it. The yeah. naming of the carts and yeah. I mean, it was great. It's good to see. Dude, we've got a big crew here now, bigger than ever. Yeah. And I'd say maybe more enthusiastic than ever. You've got a ton yeah. of seasoned riders. And I'd say more importantly, you've got a ton of new riders. And the energy that new riders bring is like, can't be beat. No, for so sure good. not. Yeah. For sure not. I think uh, we should go ride. Me too. Let's do it. Hey there, hope you're enjoying my tour around the Santa Cruz factory. If you have any questions, write them in the comments below. And if you're loving what you're doing, hit the subscribe and like button. And there are some other episodes and they will be somewhere around me.